Hey yo! What's going on, everybody? It's Tylerius, aka Ty Killington. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, man? Hanging out over here by uh, cockatoos, all the drag queens. What's going on, ladies? <laughs> Anyways, uh, this video is about the reason why Mr. Boss no longer uses my content. As you probably know, if you're in my circle or whatnot, uh, Mr. Boss, well, it all started with that Saints fan. He used one of my uh, top line drag or my straight line drag uh, tracks uh, in his video. And I hit him up on it and stuff like that. I said, hey, man, you need to give uh, credit where credit's due because they didn't you know, give me credit for using my, my material, my content. And Mr. Boss did the same thing. Now, Saint eventually gave me credit on his uh, video and he no longer uses my track. That's fine. No big deal. But he gave credit where credit's due. Uh, Mr. Boss did the same thing, but this is kind of like a weird story. Let's go into it here. So it started out with the Progen GP1 when it got released, all right? Mr. Boss, as he always does, rightfully so, you know, puts out a video about uh, talking about the car itself and things like that. And somebody uh, hit me up, one of my uh, subs, one of my friends came to one of my videos and said, hey, he left a comment and said, I think Boss used your track and, uh, you know, I don't think he gave you content or gave you credit for using your content. I was like, what? No way. I was like, huh, this is strange. You know, this happened with, with Saints fan. You know, they're buddies. And this is his uh, video right here. That's my track. That's the GP1. So uh, I went to Twitter. And I was like, wow, great. Another big YouTuber, Mr. Boss for the win, has used my content without giving me any credit. What the fuck, bro? A link and a shout is all us little guys ask for, right? And you know, I find that so funny because, you know, I went through this thing with that Saints fan. And these guys are supposed to be buddies, uh, Boss and Saints. So I'm like, huh, it's kind of fishy. I wonder what's going on here. You know, this is kind of weird. You know, why would you do this? You know, this happened. I know you saw our, our Twitter exchange back and forth. You know, so why would you be doing the same thing? So benefit of the doubt. You know, I always give the benefit of the doubt. That's just the kind of person I am. Uh, so he replied back. He said, hey, man, what content did I use? I was like, oh, this is very nice. You know, he, you know, very, very quickly responded back. I'm like, okay, maybe we can get this resolved. No big deal, right? So uh, I, I hit him back up on Twitter and I replied back and I said, uh, my top speed racetrack with the ATL sign. Same one that at Dang Sands at <laughs> that Saints fan ripped without giving credit. Uh, and bro, I said, you know, you can use it, just give credit. Hashtag link and shout. And that's exact I mean that, you know. If you guys have trouble making these tracks and things, I, I, don't, I don't know why you have trouble, but that's fine. If you gotta use it, that's okay, but you need to give credit where credit's due. And a simple, you know, link to my YouTube channel or whatever and a shout out is all you need to do. So he replies back very quickly, he says, Okay, already fixed, homie. I was like, oh, well, that's very nice. I was like, you know, thank you so much. And he responded back very quickly. And, you know, everything got taken care of. I had left messages on his thread, you know, comments on his thread saying, hey, you know, what the hell is going on? Blah, blah, blah. You know, give me con or credit for my content. So I wanted to make sure that I, you know, responded back. And well, I wanted to go check the, the video first in the description right there, right below Bruffy's GP1 test video, top speed drag track. And he linked to my social club for the track. And that's fine. You know, I would have preferred my YouTube channel, of course. But no, that's fine. As long as credit is given, that's no big deal. Uh, but once again, you know, YouTube channel would have been better. <laughs> but that's, that's fine, though. No big deal. So I respond back on Twitter. I said, hey, thank you kindly. Hashtag ATL. Hashtag Fila. Forever I love Atlanta. And uh, at that Saints fan, thank you once again for my link on your vid as well. Because, I mean, I, I, why should, first of all, they never asked to use my track. They just pulled it and used it. You know, but I wanted to be a nice guy. You know, there's I should even have had to say thank you. This is what you're supposed to damn do. But I wanted to be a nice guy too. Hey, you know, thanks so much. I even commented on the thread as of this time. My video is now linked. Everything's all good. Thanks, you know. So, fast forward to the Hijack Rustin coming out. And uh, again, one of my subs uh, comments in one of my videos is, hey, I think Mr. Boss for the win used your track again and didn't give you credit. And I was like, what the hell, man? What's going on? So I go and check out his video. And that's my track. Once again, the ATO sign. Uh, and that's, you know, you can see right there. That's, this is Mr. Boss for the win's video. That's the time right there around 640 is when it started. And I was like, no way. I mean, we just went through this. What is going on here? So uh, I checked the description. And the video came out March 21st. It is now March 31st, mind you, okay? And still, I have no link or credit given in this video that has, you know, tens of thousands of, it's a monetized video, tens of thousands of views, and still no credit is given. So I'm like, what the, we just went through this, dude. So now I know on purpose, you're trying to be a dick, all right? So I hit him up on Twitter. I just, I just make a comment out there. I say, honestly, dude, how hard is it to either give cred or just make your own straight line track for fuck's sake? I mean, really, dude. And then I replied to that on a uh, uh, on a link I sent out of proof that this is my track. So in case he wants to come back and say, oh, no, it's mine. No, 
created by Ty Killington. That's my that's my user ID. It's my gamer tag. That's my track right there. Uh, you know, that's a that's the screenshot of it. That's the picture. It is my content. All right, my stuff. Then that's you know so. At that, at that point, five days have gone by. I, you know, I put out five days gone by. Mr. Boss with a win still is not giving credit for using my content on his monetized video with over 84,000 views. Fuck you, bro. GTA Online. And uh, so, yeah. So, anyways, we fast forward now. And um, I want to show you why, you know, the uh, the new uh, Infernus came out. And he made, you know, Mr. Boss made a video on it. But uh, he didn't use my track. He didn't use anybody's track in there, actually. So, I wanted to show you why he did not use my content. I'm going all the way through on this. So you can't say, oh, you just edited together. No, I went through, you know, play a job, my jobs and, you know, my stunt races. And I'm here. I am loading it up, you know, and it's just so funny. You know, back in the day, you know, he, he mentioned, um, you know, a Bruffy just for a few moments. Right. He talked about like uh, in his videos, those 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 uh, car videos or whatever, the GP one and the rest. And he talks about, you know, timing time uh, stats with uh, Bruffy or whatever. And he shouts Bruffy out and he links his uh, YouTube channel on the video in his description and i'll tell you why back in the day uh boss and that saints fan used to rip bruffy off all the time his his information his content all that shit and bruffy never really wanted to get involved you know he only at this time he only had like 20,000 30,000 subscribers and all that and you know he just didn't want to get involved and, and call him out but bruffy's girl zertsy uh was straight savage she was like no nah, you know use my man's content to rip off his shit i ain't having that and she blew them up on twitter and all of a sudden, you know, that got a lot of traction. Tez Funds and Yan, they started linking Bruffy and stuff like that. And Bruffy started getting a lot more traction. Started getting the the respect and the notoriety that he deserves. Because Bruffy puts in a lot of uh, time and energy into this stuff. He really does. And so now he has over 100,000 subscribers. And Boss and Dat Saints fan can no longer just, you know, use his content and talk about his, his stats and his numbers without giving him credit for it. Because he's too big now. He has too much... Uh, too much push in the community, okay? He has too much pull in the community. And, and, and people know that now. So here I am, you know, 9,000 subscribers. They're like, ah, oh, you know, I'm Mr. Boss with a win. I can do what I want, bro. You know what I mean? And uh, so I, this is my track, obviously. And so when you own something in this game, you can, you know, edit it, create different things, add stuff to it. So I wanted to do that for him. I knew that he would go on this track and, and you know, try it out. And so I wanted him to see, wow, a big, beautiful, lovely, Tylarius right there covered up the ATL sign. The ATL sign is still there. Uh, I wanted to turn off my uh, radar so I can get a nice, beautiful little screenshot of this. And there it is. T-Y-L-A-R-I-O-U-S. Tylarius. That's the name of my YouTube channel. I start out all my videos saying, hey, yo, what's going on, everybody? It's Tylarius, a.k.a. Ty Killington. And uh, that's, you know, so I wanted people, I wanted him to know, hey, this is my shit, bro. I wanted other people to know that as well. But I thought, you know, maybe they'll think that this is something totally new. I've, you know, built something different just to troll him or whatever. So I wanted to show the ATL sign back there. So that, that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to drive up on the little platform over here, go to the backside. That way you can see that this is the same exact track. And honestly, I don't have to prove it to anybody. I know what it is. You guys know what it is. You already know the business on here. So that's the little ATL sign that you see in, in his videos on my track. Uh, and that's what that is right there. So let's, uh, let's, go on down the, uh, let's go on down the track here. Let's take a little ride. And we'll see if there's any other uh, additions that I made to the track to, uh, you know, kind of add to the quality of this track, to add to the essence of it. And, you know, because I know, you know, we the new Inferno uh, car came out, right? And, you know, Boss, rightfully so, once again, made a video on it. But, you know, my track is not in there. And uh, I was like, huh, I wonder why he didn't use my content. You know, is it because I kept hitting him up on Twitter? Or maybe he just came to a, you know... He was like, you know what? That's that's the wrong thing to do. If I'm not gonna give him con, or if I'm not gonna give him credit, maybe I shouldn't use his content, you know. Or maybe it's it's this right here, you know. We're driving on down, getting closer to the end. It's such a beautiful track, you know. What what is this? Is this a this a little message for boss? Is this like a little sign for him, right? Oh my God! Wow. Yeah, because it's my track, all right. Because it's my content, I can go on here and edit it. I just left a lovely little message. Fuck you, boss. Yeah, that's beautiful. You know, it's uh, it's so frustrating. You know, I, I made a comment uh, on Twitter. I was like, you know, the glitching community has more respect for, you know, people's content and, and where it comes from and things like this. And it's just so sad to see people with, you know, over a million subscribers that, for one, can't make a track like this on their under their own testing or just blatantly rip off people's shit and not give them any kind of credit at all 
for helping them gain. I mean, I, I don't care if it was one second or 10 seconds or 10 minutes or whatever. You're using my content. Give credit where credit's due. Uh, one of his fanboys commented, hey, Tylerius is just a little straight line track or whatever. And I'm like, I don't give a damn if it's a pile of shit. If you're using it in your video to throw it at people, you need to give me credit where credit's due. Hey, this is Tylerius' pile of shit. Uh, thanks so much, bro. You know, that's all. And this is all you had to do, boss. All you had to do is just give credit where credit's due and no big deal, right? And so, messages, if you're a small YouTuber, man, fight. Go out swinging, bro. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel for the illest reels content, the game. And make sure you smash, I mean, smash that like button. And stay dangerous. Peace.